this session we will see about treatment of leprosy. We will confine ourselves only to the WHO regime followed by the National Leprosy Eradication Program. First, we have to classify the patient as either posibacillary or multibacillary. This is based on three criteria. The first is the number of lesions. Posi means few. So, posibacillary patients have one to five lesions and if the patient has more than five lesions, it is multibacillary. The second criteria is peripheral nerve involvement. If the patient does not have any nerve involvement or only one nerve involved, he is classified as posibacillary and if the patient has more than one peripheral nerve involved, it is classified as multibacillary. The third criteria is skin smear. Smear is taken on all lesions and even if one lesion is found to be positive, it is classified as multibacillary and if all the lesions are negative, it is classified as posibacillary. Now, the later two criteria are standalone. What do we mean by this? If a patient has say two or three lesions but has two peripheral nerves involved, then he will be classified as multibacillary. Same way, patient has three skin lesions but has smear positive in one only one skin lesion, then again he is classified as multibacillary and not passibacillary. So this is how we will classify the patient as either posibacillary or multibacillary. Once we have done this, we, can, we are ready to start the treatment. The treatment, the duration of treatment for posibacillary is for 6 months or 24 weeks. For multibacillary, it is 48 weeks or 12 months. Now let us see how this treatment is to be given. Treatment is provided as a blister pack containing treatment for 28 days. This is a blister pack provided for treating a patient with posibacillary leprosy. Now let us see how this treatment is provided. Now you can see here on the top we have the day one treatment. Day one treatment is always administered supervised. When the patient comes to collect the drug strip, this drug has to be consumed by the patient in front of the physician or the healthcare worker. Now can you see here there are two maroon colored capsules which is nothing but two capsules of rifampin each 300. So the total dose of rifampin on day one is 600 milligram and you can see a white color tablet. This is tablet Dapso 100 milligram. So on day one capsule rifampin 600 milligram Dapso 100 milligram. On days 2 to 28 Dapso 100 milligram daily is taken. This is taken unsupervised by the patient. So once this trip will come for 28 days or 4 weeks, after 4 weeks the patient again comes to the hospital, is given one more strip. So same way he will be given treatment for 24 weeks. So he has to be issued 6 strips to complete the treatment. So this is the treatment of posibacillary leprosy, the strips, blister packs or green color coded. Now let us see the treatment of multibacillary leprosy. This is the blister pack which is to be provided for a patient of multibacillary leprosy. Again you can see here day one treatment is available separately as a strip above and for the treatment for days 2 to 28 is available separately below. As already told day one treatment is to be consumed in front of the physician or healthcare provider supervised. Now let us see what is available here. You can see here there are three capsules. These three capsules are of clofazimine 100 mg each. So clofazimine 300 mg is given on day one. Down you can see here two capsules of rifampin 300 mg each is consumed. So rifampin, capsule rifampin 600 mg and there is one single round white tablet this Dapsol 100 mg. So on day one supervised Rifampin capsule rifampin 600 mg 
कैप्सूल क्लोफास एमी थ्री हंड्रेड मिलीग्राम टैबलेट डैप्सोल हंड्रेड मिलीग्राम इज गिवन नाउ लेट सी वॉट इज प्रोवाइडेड और वॉट इज टू बी टेकन बाय द पेशेंट ऑन डेज टू टू ट्वेंटी एट यू कैन सी हियर इट हैज अ स्मॉल बेरून कलर कैप्सूल एंड अ वाइट टैबलेट सो दिस इज टैबलेट इज अ कैप्सूल क्लोफास एमी फिफ्टी मिलीग्राम एंड टैबलेट डैप्सोल हंड्रेड मिलीग्राम so these two drugs are taken together on days 2 to 28 so this is treatment re uh, regime for multi basilary epilepsy so same way this strip will come for 28 days once this is over he again comes and a new strip is issue on day 1 he consumes the drug in front of the physician and so on so 12 such strips will be used so the total treatment is for 48 weeks so this is the treatment for multi basilary epilepsy to end with this therapy is called as multi drug therapy mdt we saw that in tb it is called as dots directly observed treatment short course the treatment of epilepsy is called as multi drug therapy so this is in short about the treatment of epilepsy posi basilary and multi basilary epilepsy if you have any doubts please get back to us thank you